32-year-old Jordan is looking for his first home with the help of his girlfriend, Marina. Hi. Hey, how you going? Good, how are you? I'm Tony, nice, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Jordan, Tony, how, how you going, going buddy? Nice, nice to see you, buddy. Hey, who's hey. Today, it's time for some home truths about home loans. Basically, what we want to get out of today is work out what you're trying to achieve. Yep. One, around how much you want to spend, how much you want to be in debt for, how long you want before you've paid it off, and things like that. Yep. Jordan's hoping to find something less than $600,000. Mortgage broker Tony wants him to keep $20,000 in an emergency fund, leaving him with an $80,000 deposit. So if we look at a purchase price of $600,000, you still will have some government fees and charges. I'll estimate those to be around $5,000. So to complete the transaction, you're looking at $605,000. That means we'd be going to a, a lender and asking for $525,000. What do you reckon my monthly repayments would be on this loan if I did, say, acquire a property for that 600 k mark? The minimum repayment you would be looking at, principal and interest, you're looking at $2,241.94 per month. Okay. That's kind of close to what yeah. we guessed. Armed with the facts, they're ready to get cracking. Rain, hail or shine. So, today's inspection, in the rain. First one. <laughs> Fun never stops. This villa unit in Melbourne's leafy east comes in well under budget, with a price guide of $520,000 to $560,000. And it even has a courtyard. Buyer's advocate Christy is a big fan of the price, location and land value. I think this is... <laughs> this is I love it. I love it. Yeah. First time, maybe it's it. Yeah. <laughs> so what did you think, Jordan? Um... It's dunk. It's so dunk. Yeah, I got a bit of a shock when I walked in. I was like, whoa. <laughs> this is a bit scary. I okay, I definitely smoked a lot of cigarettes in there. This place is going to take around $15,000 and some serious elbow grease just to make it livable. Is our couple up to the challenge? You gotta see the potential when you look at it. You gotta see like, I'm gonna put that there, I'm gonna put that there, not like, this is a smelly shell. It's really like a buy and flip in, what, a year or so, two years kind of thing. Not like a, this is the house I'm gonna live in for a while. Yeah. You know what I mean? I don't know, it's a tough one. Mm. 